My name is Shreya Boshak and today I am going to discuss about the business insights derived from the Superstore sales analysis in Excel. So let us first know what the data set is about. The data set is one of the historical sales of supermarket company which has been recorded in three different branches of Myanmar that is branch A, branch B and branch C for the months of January, February and March in the year 2019. So the objectives of the project is to analyze the weekly and monthly revenue and profit, the top three profitable product lines, profitable cities and branches, month-on-month -month growth, gender-wise sales based on customer types, product lease liked by the customer and to enhance sales and profit further. Now let us see the business insights derived from the data set. We have 5510 total quantity sold across all the product lines dollar 3,7587 is the total cost of goods sold 3,22,967 is our total revenue 15,379 is our gross profit and 4.76% is our gross margin percentage So now let us see what product lines does the superstore offer We have foods and beverages uh, fashion accessories, electronic accessories, health and beauty, home and lifestyle and sports and travel and among them food and beverages gives us the highest revenue. Now as it is evident from the bar plot, Napitao, the capital of Myanmar has the highest profit followed by Yangtun and Mandalay. So we have uh, the top three profitable product lines that is sports and travels, home and lifestyle and foods and beverages. Where foods and beverages has the highest revenue and home and lifestyle has the second lowest revenue and sports and travel have the highest quantity sold. Now if you talk about gender wise sales based on customer type we can see that in both the customer types female account for more sales than um, than males and members brought in more sales than normal. Now if we talk about month on month growth then, then February had a downward trend that is negative MOM growth and March has an upward trend compared to February and also January is our highest profit month. Now if we come to the insights and recommendations we can see that fashion accessories being the most expensive and electronic accessories being the cheapest product line do not constitute the top 3 profitable product lines. Home and lifestyle and electronic accessories have maximum ratings in the average categories and hence needs improvement in their ratings. Since members brought in more revenue and gross income to the business than normal customers, so more customer acquisition in the member category will be beneficial for the business. Also, there is one more factor to look at that is since gross income is just 5% and tax rate is 5%, the store is selling products as COGS and each product has the same value for the gross margin percentage as a result. So the company must focus on increasing sales and profit and thus reducing COGS. So this is the snapshot of the dashboard we have. So if I show it in Excel, then it looks like this and we have months as our slicer so and product lines also as our slicers <coughs> and we have member and normal that is the customer type as slicer if we click here we can see the recommendations and here through this VBA code we can see the weekly trends of transactions revenue CHS etc thus we have come to the end of our discussion and Thank you all for watching.